Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. IRS issues guidance and updates frequently asked questions related to new, previously owned, and qualified commercial clean vehicle credits. Yes, I had some questions regarding the topic. Can my vehicle still be classified as clean, even so some cracked up vagrant in San Francisco defecated on it? Also, could a car still be considered clean after being used as a filming location by like an OnlyFans girl or something? And I would think it'd be completely impossible to still consider a car as clean after being used as a place of political negotiation by like Hunter Biden. Well, I guess if the car gets dirty, he could just clean it up using the classified documents scattered all over the floorboards of the car as like paper towels or something, but still, in any case, did, do you get more credit points if the qualified commercial clean vehicle was actually in a commercial? Kind of like the way Hollywood people get stuff for being famous, but this time, you, you know, for cars. And my, my car is not quite qualified as clean because it's not electric or anything. But I did demand to have one of those electronic cigarette lighters in it still, you know, because they, they try to take that out. And I was like, no, you better you better give me my electronic cigarettes lighter. So I'm still lighting my cigarettes using electric power instead of, you know, the fossil fuels in my lighter. And I feel like I should get something for that, you know. And no, no, I don't mean cancer. I mean, like, I, I, I should get money. I should get money for that, you know. Also... I painted my car to look like a koala bear. So even though it's not technically qualified, it is koalified, which is pretty close. You know, that's pretty close. I feel like that should be close enough to, to get the credit. Have you ever wondered where the term or the origins of por supuesto were? You see, poor Sue was upset about her tax bill, but then she learned her car qualifies for a tax credit and presto. She was then happy. Of course she was happy. So it was like poor Sue, but then presto, she was happy now. Hence the term poor Sue presto. Poor Sue presto. Of course. Stay tuned for more deep dives into the etymology of words. But first, let's keep reading the news. IR 2023-18, February 3rd, 2023, Washington. The Internal Revenue Service today issued notice 2023-16. There's a link to that here that modifies the definitions of certain vehicle classifications for the new previously owned and qualified commercial clean vehicle credits. As a result of this notice, the IRS updated the related frequently asked questions, the FAQs for this credits. Uh, today's guidance modifies notice 2023-01. There's a link to that here by changing the vehicle classification standard by which vans, sport utility vehicles, pickup trucks, and other vehicles are defined. Fact sheet 2023-4, there's a link to that here, updates frequently asked questions related to new, previously owned, and qualified commercial clean vehicles. The FAQ's revisions are as follows. So you got topic A has a change to it, which relates to the eligibility rules for the new clean vehicle credit, question one and eight. Topic B has a change to it, income and price limitations for the new clean vehicle credit, question one, or sorry, question two, six, eight, nine, and added new question seven. Topic C, when the new question <clears throat> requirements apply to new clean vehicle credit, the question seven, and then topic D, eligibility rules for the previously owned clean vehicle credit. Question four, a lot of changes here. Topic uh, G, qualified commercial clean vehicle credit. <clears throat> Question six, these FAQs are being issued to provide general information to taxpayers, tax professionals, and others interested in the issue as exp ex expeditiously. They love that word. I keep on messing it up as expeditiously as possible. More information about Reliance is available. There's a link to that here. So if you want some more information about that particular credit to see if you qualify to answer some of those crucial questions we took, at, took a look at, they might be included in here. I don't know. Sometimes they don't cover the deep stuff, the really difficult questions like we looked at. But in any case, you can, you can check it out and see if, if they do or do not. There'll be a link to this in the description.